They say patience pays off, but when it comes to the Galaxy S26, that wait might be longer than fans expected. And for a very specific reason, Samsung isn't just delaying for the sake of it. It's reportedly pushing the boundaries of what a flagship phone can do, both in design and in raw power. But here's where things get really interesting. New leaks suggest Samsung's next. Unpacked event will not only come later than usual, but might also redefine how Samsung positions its top tier smartphones moving forward. Hey everyone, welcome back, Sam here. If you enjoy staying ahead in the world of tech, don't forget to hit that like button, share this video with your fellow gadget lovers, and subscribe for more exciting updates coming your way. Alright, so here's the scoop. Samsung's next big event, the Galaxy S26 launch, is now rumored for February 25th, 2026, live from San Francisco. Sounds ordinary, right? Not quite. This marks the first time since 2018 that Samsung has scheduled a Galaxy S launch this late in the year. The Galaxy S20 for dropped mid-January, the S25 came early in 2025. But the S26? It's taking a full extra month. Why? Sources say it's all part of a strategic realignment and a few surprise decisions that could change. Samsung's lineup entirely? Remember those earlier. Rumors about a rebranding, calling the base model the S26 Pro and the Plus version the S26 Edge? Yeah, that's been scrapped. Samsung seems to have realized that people love the names they already know. So we're back to the Galaxy S26, S26 Plus, and S26 Ultra, the familiar trio, but with some unexpected twists. Now, here's where the story gets even more intriguing. The so-called S to 6 Edge might still exist, but it's no longer part of the main launch. Instead, it could debut later in the year, similar to how the S25 Edge appeared months after the core lineup. This means Samsung might be spacing out its big reveals to keep fans hyped all year. Long, a smart move if you think about it. The timing also lines up perfectly with the Mobile World Congress 2026, just a week later in Barcelona. By launching before MWC, Samsung gets to dominate the headlines and steal the spotlight from competitors. And choosing San Francisco as the stage? That's no coincidence either. The city's become a global epicenter for AI innovation, and Samsung's leaning heavily into that with the Galaxy S26 lineup. Expect deeper integration of Galaxy AI, building upon the foundation set with the S25 series, but this time, on a whole new level, reports suggest that Samsung might even showcase new partnerships with AI-focused tech giants during the event. Think smarter scene recognition, live translation on steroids, and next-level image processing that adapts in real time. The Galaxy S26 Ultra, in particular, is rumored to be a powerhouse, not just in photography, but in AI-assisted features that learn from your habits and optimize performance accordingly. Speaking of performance, here's the big headline. Samsung's Exynos 2600 chip, built on an advanced 2 nanometer process, is reportedly set to power the S26 lineup. And get this, even the Ultra model could feature Exynos in some regions, which hasn't happened in years. Early benchmarks show the Exynos 2600 going head-to-head -head with Qualcomm's Snapdragon 8 Gen 4, meaning Samsung's back in the game ready to compete with the best, but that's not all. New design leaks are painting a much clearer picture of what the Galaxy S26 will look like. A set of leaked screen protectors for the S to 6S to 6 Plus and S26 Ultra confirm one key change, rounded corners across all models. No more boxy edges for the Ultra. Samsung's going for a more unified, modern look that feels smoother in the hand and more consistent across the lineup. It's subtle, but trust me, these small refinements add up to a much more premium aesthetic dotto. And those bezels? Practically invisible. The leaks show ultra-thin, perfectly balanced bezels on all sides, something Samsung has been chasing for years. The result could be one of the cleanest, most symmetrical displays ever seen on a Galaxy flagship. Combined with that curved design, 
The S26 series might just deliver one of the most immersive screens Samsung's ever made. The Ultra, as expected, will stay massive, round 6.8 inches, but the softened corners could actually make it more comfortable to hold, especially for gaming and binge watching. And with AI enhanced visuals, it's not just about looking good, it's about feeling futuristic. Some fans might be disappointed by the delay, but honestly, it looks more like precision than procrastination. Samsung seems to be using that extra month to fine tune its hardware and software, making sure the Galaxy S26 lineup launches as close to flawless as possible. And strategically, it gives Samsung a head start before MWC, setting the tone for the entire smartphone season if these leaks hold true. February 25, 2026 could be a major turning point for Samsung, unveiling not just a refined design and upgraded AI features, but also proving that sometimes, waiting just a little longer is totally worth it.